welcome dear students in accounting education and today we will explain estimation of future cash flows it means uh, in this we make the planning of uh, estimation of future cash flows it is the topic of uh, financial management and uh, for uh, evaluating a project we need uh, two types of cash flows one is cash outflow and other is cash inflow cash outflow is the cost of project cost of project project and uh, cash inflow is revenue from project was uh, uh i purchased 10 million sheep it is the cost of project and total profit from this project is uh, 20 million in 5 uh, years so we have to estimate this amount and we have to estimate this amount how to estimate so my objective is to explain how to estimate this amount first step estimate estimate the cost of project what cost we will include it purchasing of asset fix asset its estimation plus additional cost cost of removal of old machines old fixed asset this will, will be also a part of cost of project and third of uh, additional cost of install of uh, fixed asset in the plant or factory and plus estimation estimation of inflation cost because uh, during the increasing of prices uh, our cost will increase so we will add inflation cost now all these costs uh, are the part of a cost of project now we estimate estimation of cash revenue what total revenue we will receive in the form of cash 
फर्स्ट एस्टिमेट सेल वाई वी आर परचेजिंग प्रोजेक्ट फॉर प्रोडक्शन फॉर इनक्रीज द सेल सो वी एस्टिमेट टोटल सेल विच वी आर एक्सपेक्ट फ्रॉम दैट प्रोजेक्ट प्लस इट्स इन्फ्लेशनल वैल्यू suppose uh, what uh, amount of inflation will affect sale and uh, minus cash expenses these are revenue expenses and this will be estimation of uh, revenue that are cash revenue for estimation of cash inflow deduct tax and uh, we will not deduct uh, dividend and uh, interest on loan because both are cost of capital and uh, we just compare cash outflow and cash inflow for knowing our return on investment and in, and this will be estimation of cash inflow okay i think you understand how to estimate but things in estimation of future cash flows